we're going to go over how to do the um, ab here. And it's an exercise that people do completely wrong quite a bit. And uh, the reason is it makes it easier over the mistakes I just went over in the article. So I'm going to show you what the mistakes are and then how to correct them. So what we usually see here is when people do this, they start with their butt out like this. And generally keep it out there. It might come down OK. And then what will happen here is they'll bring their hips out to come back. That makes it a lot easier, and you're really not placing any stretch in your abs at all. So what we want to do here is get your knees together, your feet should be together behind you. That should all be in line. You also want the wrists in line as well. A lot of times people do the ab roll the same, the wrist will hurt. It's usually let the wrist break like this. You want to keep that straight here the entire time. So I have the wheel directly underneath my shoulders, and see what I just did here is I just brought my hips down, so my shoulder is really my head my knees is going to be a nice straight line, so what you want right here, you want to maintain that throughout the lift here. So as I roll out, I'm keeping my hips down. I'm also not letting my lower back round or uh, round in like this. You want to watch for that. Someone who's not quite strong enough to roll out very far, they're going to let this happen and they're going to feel their back, not their abs. So what I usually tell people here is to, this would be arching here, what you want to try to do is pull your ribs down, that's going to keep your back flat. So that's a good cue I picked up that the ribs go down, that'll keep this all flat in line. So think about doing that as you do the wheel. So I'm going to keep my low back flat, keep my ribs down, hold that in place, keep that locked in as I roll this. So my wrists are straight, arms are straight, underneath my shoulders, and now I'm going to roll out. As I go out, I'm going to stop just short of the floor and come right back. As I come back, my hips stay in line, okay? So I'm going to come right out again, almost touch, and back. My hips stay right down the whole time. Push your butt down, abs are tight. You're going to feel your abs the entire time that way, okay? It'll be a big difference if you're not used to that, okay? But like I said, you're going to see people let this sag in. Or they might even start out okay, and they'll try to roll out too far. It might be good, they'll be good, and then it's too far, and then that'll happen, okay? So with beginners here, just have them roll out a little bit. So we have, I have lines here for the mats in my gym. So we'll do some time just say, all right, just roll out to the line in front of you. So instead of going out all the way, they might be able to go out that far. That's fine. So that's the range of motion for right now. As they get stronger, they'll be able to go out a little further until they can go out all the way. Okay? So give that a shot. 